French President Emmanuel Macron arrived in Algeria Thursday evening with a team of 90 people for a high-pressure state visit. The goal? To mend fractured ties with the former French colony, particularly now when the nation's oil and gas reserves could prove important due to the war in Ukraine and the energy crisis threatening Europe. Algeria, a country of almost 44 million people, marks its 60th anniversary of independence. And the relationship between the two is complicated, with repeated crises and heightened tensions over conflicting memories of Algeria's bloody war of independence from France. But both sides have since expressed desire to move forward. The first stop on the agenda was a visit to a monument to martyrs of Algeria's independence war, a recurring theme for the visit. With 4 million Algerians living in France and growing migration across the Mediterranean into Europe, Macron wants the main focus of the visit to be about the future opportunities between the countries. But on the street, the expectations for the visit are low. It's a state visit between two presidents. If the French head of state comes here, it is to seek what France wants from Algeria. Much of Algeria's oil and gas is still untapped, and with the right investments, the country is geographically well-placed to help Europe with its energy supplies, something that could benefit both sides and help Algeria to secure revenue streams.